Hi there. This is Alex from Essential Web Apps. And, in this video, we will learn a little bit about grid systems in UI design. And, the proper size of a bootstrap standard grid. But before we get into it, we make videos regularly. If you want to see videos like this, please hit the subscribe button, and click the bell icon for notification. Now, before we go into the Figma, like we always do. Let's understand the concept of the grid system in web design. Well, when it comes to web development. Grid system works as a small container, where you can place your element, and move around within the individual grid box area. But when it comes to UI design. Grid actually, a set of columns. These columns guide you to place your elements in proper alignment with consistency. Grid is something, that gives a certain rule to your design. And, if I, quote, Monica Geller here, rules control the fun. Or, in this case, your design. So now, if we go to the Bootstrap website. Click Doc, we will find Layout. Now click Grid. If we just scroll down a little, we will see this table. This table has all the information that we need. It has all screen sizes. Bootstrap follows 12 column standard, with 1.5 RAM or 24 pixel gutter. And, 0.75 RAM or 12 pixel margin on either side of the columns. Now, let's go to the Figma. As you can see, I already made frames in 4 different sizes. The smallest one is 540 pixel wide. Then this one is 720 pixel. This one is 992 pixel. And finally the largest one is 1200 pixel wide. Now, making a grid in Figma is really very easy. Just click on a frame. You can click here, or here. Now, as you can see on the right side. It says, Layer Grid. Just click the plus. Change grid to column. We need 12 columns here. Need it in the center. As we see in the website, gutter 24 pixel. And, for 1200 pixel screen, we need a 76 pixel wide column. This size will ensure 12 pixel of margin on either side by maintaining the 24 pixel gap. Now move on to the next screen size. I will repeat the same process. Now, for 992 pixel screen size, the column size should be 59 pixel. It will approximately maintain the 12 pixel margin, with a 24 pixel gap. For 720 pixel screen size, I put column size, 36 pixel. Finally, for 540 pixel wide, screen resolution, the column size is 21 pixel. So, just like this. You can easily set a column guide for your UI design. So, there you go. What's else you want to know about Figma? Let me know in the comment section. And, if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And, I will see you in the next video.